It's already run out. All right. Well, that's open. All it needs is a name. Also a connection to the exit. Might be a good idea. What do guests want? I'm running out of cash. Do I have an ATM? Uh, no, I don't. Well, my work here is done. I feel sick. I want to go home. It's too crowded. I'm not hungry. Great scenery. The litter is great. The path is disgusting. I feel sick. I'm thirsty. I'm not thirsty. I can't afford an umbrella. Well, it's not raining. I don't know why you need one. I'm just making mental inventory of all the things you can't buy. I can't afford a Ferrari. I can't afford a house. Hmm. Want to call it the neck breaker? What if bad translator calls it the neck breaker? Let's see. Get rid of that. Uh, I want to make neck breaker one word. It might not come out. Neck breaker. Oh, with a K. Boosh. The neck breaker, neck breaker, neck breaker, neck breaker, neck breaker. Hmm. Switch of neck, course changes. It sure has. The course changes, changing course, change of course. Hmm. Change of course, change of course, of course, change. It's so obvious. Of course. Perfect. What else would it be? Let's see. Can I afford a new Bugatti? No, I'm afraid not. I can probably... Given what's in my checking account right now, gotta see what the going rate on uh, early 90s Honda Civics would be. I think that might be in my price range. Although I do have enough money to get rid of this guy. And that's all that matters. Sell all of my Nintendo stock. Oh god, it's probably worth about 50 cents at this point. Can you guys just like all go out and buy a Wii U? Like maybe 20 of them? A bunch of games? You know, Nintendo stock's kind of in the dumper. Also, these people are coming out of this track. It's totally safe. Uh, I'll eventually go over to Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 when uh, I'm done with this game. But there's a bunch to go. I don't even own a Wii U. I have a Wii, which is just sort of an emulator box at this point. It's just full of Genesis games really bad Genesis games to boot. Oh, it's broken! Come on, speed bum. Save that. $3,400. It's pretty good, but I need more. I think it's propaganda time. Six-week ad campaign. Uh... My name is Free Rides. Actually, no. Free Rides on the... The really bad... Oh, my name is is the Merryground. Never mind. That's the cheapest thing. Might as well make it that. Lose less money, free coffee, and an ad campaign for... Uh, whatever... Oh, I never named that. Looping Roller Coaster 1. Fun. Did I add dinosaurs to the last ride? I didn't. I guess I could. Let's see, it's 6.84, throw a bunch of dinosaur bones around it, and I'm out of money. Three months left, eh, it should be fine. I think, actually. I'm not sure. Though the log flume doesn't need more, people will pay 10 bucks with the excitement way lower than that. God damn it, guys, spend money better. I should invest in Steam. I don't think Steam is publicly traded. Or Valve, or whatever the parent company is. Steam Valve. I think it's Valve. 
Apparently Facebook stopped being awful. Not like I own any. Apparently that stopped being kind of disappointing. Steam controller, yeah, that thing. I don't know what to make of it. I haven't touched it. But I would kinda like some analog sticks on it to be honest. But you know, if if it's designed well, I guess it's fine. Only um only concern I've got with the Steam controller is that are they trying to make a controller that's good for every possible game on Steam and therefore isn't really ideal for any of them? I mean, if it's as good as the couple of people who had hands-on said it is, then I guess there's really nothing to worry about, but... I don't know. Touchpads. They're a thing. If I played Syndicate, I haven't. I'm not really complaining about it per se, I think it looks interesting, but it's just a radical departure from what I normally use for controllers. And my experience with like touch anything for controlling things is kinda crappy, honestly. Well, Tracer Tong, I kind of figured that the developers they gave the Steam controller to would not say, like, hey, I got really early access to this thing from this beloved company, and man oh man, does this product suck. I kind of feel like any initial impressions that would come out of it from just the specific group of people would be positive. Like, they, they wouldn't give it to people, or they wouldn't really, I don't think, plan it in such a way where they would get negative feedback immediately from the controller out of the gate. But maybe... Maybe I'm just being too cynical and it's really the best thing. We will see. And if anyone from Valve is listening, I'd totally take one, by the way. I'm very easily bribed. I don't make any money, so anything you want to bribe me with is totally fine. Hey, Deshant. Yeah, if you can play Roller Coaster Tycoon with the Steam controller, it's a good controller. And we're almost at 700 guests, so I guess I don't have to worry about that total anymore. Oh, thanks, Temptress. Appreciate it. Thank my parents, I guess. I had nothing to do with it. I just popped out sounding like this. Uh, do we have ATMs yet? No, we don't. I can make hot dogs? It's almost the same thing. Fine. Why not? Hmm. Hot dog stall one. A dollar, that's a good deal. Let's not make it that. I need profits. No, I don't think I've ever been sent... No, no, I take the back. I was going to say, I've never been sent product to evaluate, but then I remember in freshman year of uh, college, I tried to get... Uh, I tried to get into that whole do surveys for money thing online, and I was sent a box of cereal. In fact, I might still have an image of it. Um, generic O's. Uh, I was sent a box of cereal that was just white and uh, I don't know if that's a legitimate spoiler, I don't really watch the show, but you might not want to show it off anyway. Uh, but anyway, I'd watched a, um, or not watched, I had gotten a box of cereal in the mail. It was a white box with some uh, black text on it. And it's like, if the Soviet Union had aisles and aisles of cereal, it would look like that. It's super, like, functional, only labeling. And it was, I think... God, what was... What was, um... 
Oh god, let me check. I have an image saved of the box. Long story short, the ser or the serial eventually got released commercially as Crave, I think. Kellogg's Crave sounds about right. It had chocolate in it. Here it is. Experimental O's dot JPEG. Milk flavored chocolate cereal. Delicious. And it actually was pretty good. I was just sent this in the mail and they said, hey, eat this. So I did. And I've never had it again. Also, they sent me a survey, which I never filled out. I just got free cereal in the mail and didn't contribute anything to the product. So, as much as I'd like to say, my feedback shaped what Crave is today. I just ate it and never did anything. I'm sorry, Kellogg's, if you're listening. It was wrong of me. Let me make it up to you, send me more cereal, and I'll fill out the survey this time. How was it? It was pretty good. It's like if you had Captain Crunch and filled it with cereal, or uh, with uh, chocolate. That's probably the only way I can describe it. I ate the survey and filled out the cereal. That's how it went. Milk cereal flavored chocolate. But that is the only piece of product I've ever been sent to evaluate ever, and given the fact I never sent in the actual evaluation, it'll probably be the only one I get. Which is a shame, because I'm totally down for free stuff. Which may or may not cause cancer if you eat it. I'm fairly sure Crave doesn't. Probably. Yeah, what if I grew a third ear? Then I could be a tester for the new uh, Rice Krispies and evaluate Snap, Crackle, and Pop. Well, the thing with surveys, if you ever took them online for money, is that they're looking for a very specific demographic. And I think they have a quota for certain demographics they want to hear from. So if you say, hey, I want to take this survey, fill out demographic data. I am 21 white college male. It, it like ends immediately and says, oh, well, we don't need your input. Thanks anyway. So I feel like the only way to actually get the surveys done is just to make up a story about some, you know, the least, or like, whoever is, um, I'm blanking, hang on, just come up with a story, come up with a person who is totally dissimilar from you in every way possible, and maybe then you won't be kicked out of every survey ever, but at the end of the day, you're making, like, pennies on the dollar for an hour, hour, hourly wage, yeah, excuse me, it's one in the morning and I s can't really talk anymore. Hmm. The only way to do surveys is to lie. Not saying that. Directly, anyway. Is this me? Probably. Yeah. That's me. That's why I don't have a webcam up. That's what I'm doing right now. Right then to Donut, thank you for watching. Let's see. I'm an elderly Japanese man. Now you know. Hmm. You know, I should probably try to build this closer to the entrance. I'm sort of just building it farther and farther away, meaning I'm going to run out of money and never get it back. Do I still stream while wearing a bikini? Sure. Whatever floats your boat. Uh, it's not going to go. He looks up, maybe. 400? 411 bucks. 
That's money I will never get. This ride will probably be incomplete until the end of the scenario. What's my park rating? I'm like 7 something. 764. You don't really have to worry too much about park rating as long as it's like a little bit past the midpoint. There we go. And straight and turn. And turn. I have 700 guests already. I won. You don't really win until the time runs out, though. That's the problem. There's no time speed up. It just sort of goes... Sort of here for the long haul. God damn it! I just want to finish this ride! It's got so much potential. Hmm. Oh, it's almost there. Let's build that park down. Oh, then crashes into itself. Can I speed up time by overclocking my computer? If only. Also, Tracer Tong, I could probably go for some Chinese takeout right now. <laughs> Don't bring it up. I'm actually really hungry at the moment. I had dinner and a bunch of tea. And that was pretty much it. One day I will learn how to eat multiple meals a day. Or at least how to eat breakfast again. Ever since I went to college, I sort of stopped eating breakfast altogether. I feel like I'd rather just uh, sleep an hour later than have breakfast. I've never valued sleep as much as I have since I came to college. Have I ever considered a mod to boost the time by 30%? I haven't. I'm just playing it straight up, unmodded, vanilla, everything. Because once you start cheating, where does it end? Oh god, my park rating. Oh god. Oh god. Why is it barf? Wait, wait, wait. Where did this all come from? Everything is vomit. Why are you the worst handyman ever? You. X Crusade X. You're a handyman. You. Psy Omega. I think I already named you something, didn't I? Oh, no, I didn't. Never mind. Save the park. Everything is puke. Coffee is a great replacement for breakfast. Coffee is a great replacement for anything. Any meal, really. God damn it! Go back up! This dream brought to you by 7 Eleven. I just need to finish this ride and then everyone will have faith in the park again. on. No. You're not leaving the park. Can I have the rest of your money? You only spent a buck sixty. You're never gonna go home. You're too far from the entrance. It's for the greater good. Hmm. This park is as dead as StarCraft 2. Oh yeah, I guess that's not really as much of a thing anymore. Can't say I've really kept up, but... It seems like League of Legends is the new thing in town. Should be. Roller Coaster Tycoon, though, I would say. I mean, it's kind of real-time strategy. In a way. Maybe strategy. Maybe not how I play, though. There should be a competitive roller coaster tycoon league. We should make one. Unlike StarCraft 2, League of Legends requires neither skill, presence, nor planning. Hey, it's just like Roller Coaster Tycoon. I should play that. Also, this needs a break or it's going to fly off the end and everyone's going to die. Let's see. 
four. It's come to a dead stop. That sounds safe. Eh, yeah, photo. Yeah, why not? Get that photo money. And test, entrance, exit, and go. Godspeed game. Oh wait, hang on. Gotta increase the chain speed. Seven miles of blazing speed. Per hour. This is gonna crash. It's gonna be fine. It looks... mostly safe. Mostly harmless. It could go fast enough to crash. I think it crashes at like 25 or 30 miles an hour. And that'll definitely hit this. But I don't think there's any place where it's going to go so slow that it uh, comes back on itself. There you go. Do I watch speedruns? Not really. I used to watch uh, SIG a whole bunch, I think a year ago. I just don't really watch a whole lot of streams at this point. I'm just busy with college stuff. It's like if I'm not streaming on my own, I'm probably doing school related things. Or sleeping. Look, every. You can consider every single run of Roller Coaster Tycoon to be a speed run because the game ends when the objective. or when the time is over, so every time is always the best time. It's always exactly two hours, or three hours, or whatever, on the dot. Every single time. Which is great. We're all tied for first. Everyone's a winner. Let's see. Hey, 6.72. That's okay. We need some dinosaurs, though. We could probably make this 7.2 at least. 7.2, I mean. How is reliving high school in Persona 4? Oh man, I loved it. One day I will play uh, Persona 4 on stream from like beginning to end. And then I will die because it's like 70 hours of uninterrupted gameplay. It would require a way to capture the Vita though. Losing guests. Oh yeah, you're right. I should get ad campaigns. Oh, by the way, uh, I don't have a gigantic friends list on any Sony anything, so if anyone wants to be PlayStation broskies, can add me, I guess. That's my name. I'm Rad Booley. It's like Boo Radley, but that was already taken. I could have a big list of friends and pretend I'm popular. Yeah. Oh. I haven't added you. Every request that ever went through, I added. I just hit add all for everything. I don't discriminate. Go. Must finish ride connection. Hope people are buying my $20 umbrellas. There we go. That seems safe. Excitement, 7.16, good enough. You don't know why you're watching the stream. Me neither, but I'm glad you're here. Look, $20 for an umbrella in the grand scheme of things doesn't seem to be too much. I mean, maybe in a world where you can build a full roller coaster for a couple grand, yeah, maybe it's a tad much. But. Hey, in real life, that's not such a bad price. Hmm. Why do people just bounce back in the exit? What do they think is going to be at the end of this? Capturing Sony devices is actually pretty easy. Well, with the Vita, the only way to capture it at present is to send it to some dude in Japan who puts in a video mod, which is like 250 bucks. Which sounds nice and all, but I don't have any money for that. 
No, I don't make the entrance anything. Entrance is actually locked at free in this. You can't change it. Well, I got the green arrow back. The park is saved. Let me just have an ad campaign for Looping Roller Coaster 1. Yeah, no, no money. Let's not make it that much. Four weeks. That's fine. You could put a Do Not Enter sign by the exit, but then people will say, Oh no! I want to go home, but I don't know how to get to the exit. When it's right in front of them, and then your park rating plummets, and then you lose, and... No one's happy. Damas Panda's work on Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. I would imagine. Get the new iPhone and we can FaceTime. Sure, random internet stranger, I'd love to. I should stream Persona 3 Portable, eh, portable start to finish. That I could do. PSP does video out, okay? But I've already started my playthrough of that. Let's see. Oh, I don't have any money for the new iPhone either, which shouldn't, supi shouldn't surprise anyone, excuse me. Oh yeah, I forgot I even made this. The least interesting ride in the park. Might be buying Pokemon X or Y. Nah, I don't think so. I've sort of fallen out of Pokemon. Oh, come on. You're so close to the path. No, no, if you ever want to go home, just go on the path and you'll be fine. You'll be free, guess 270. Oh, now you're walking away. Oh. Oh, hang on. Oh. Represents man's inner struggle or something. He'll make it eventually. Oh, who am I kidding? No, I won't. Stream more when I can. I've just been busy. It's been exam city over here. Does he leave? I don't feel like watching him, but let's put a name on and see if he ever goes. Also, by the way, computer screen just flashed. I think my video card's going out, so if the stream kind of just crashes randomly, just a heads up on that. Should be okay, but every now and then the screen has been kind of flickering a bit, and I think the laptop's on the way out. So, uh... Just the heads up of the stream goes dead without any warning. Is my printer still a machine gun? No, I threw that one out. That one... I haven't had since at least last semester. No more jammed printers for me. Hey, 787. That's pretty good. Saber for the crash. Ah, eh, might as well. Are my video drivers up to date? I have no idea. It's it's just been very finicky, this computer, ever since I bought it. Like, I had multiple blue screens of death the first day I bought the thing. And why I didn't send it back then and there is beyond me. I guess it just really wanted a new computer, but it's sort of very disgruntled now and then. It gets into moods where sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. Is the red coaster clipping into the water ride? Sure is. That's how you know it's safe. You know, it's a refreshing dip as you go around the loop as you smack your face on the log flume track. It's two rides for the price of one. How could you go wrong? It's an MC Escher sort of perspective going on there. Hmm. That's been doing alright. I thought this had another car in it though. Oh, it does. It's got three. I've heard good things about Zoo Tycoon, I just haven't played it. 
I will one day. I was sent a copy in the mail. In the old P.O. box. But, just haven't gotten around to playing it. Also, that does clip there, too. This track's running on that track. If I were a nut, what nut would I be? A peanut. Best kind of nut. Oh, thanks, Boom3. Appreciate it. Although I stream entirely too much Roller Coaster Tycoon, I think. Sort of to the exclusion of all else. Escher Tycoon. They have a crooked house here, not in this scenario, but in general. I guess that's kind of the same thing. Eh, I've got some free money. Might as well make... Make some dodgems. Pretend I'm British. Alright. You know, big pillar just clipping through the roof, but that's fine. That's what makes it fun. I should do a rerun of my boyfriend. Oh no. No more of that. Please. I think one playthrough of my boyfriend is enough. Why don't I make my lines bigger? The little roller coaster is full all the time. What? If I made my lines bigger, then... How would that help? I would just have an even longer queue time, and then people would complain. Although, that's right. Uh, on this game, you can actually put TVs there, so people will stay online even longer than they used to. Which is a new thing in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, and not in any other game before it. And I keep forgetting about it. It's probably a good thing to put there. There's a game called My Boyfriend. There sure is. It's German. The save file is... here. It's My Boyfriend Er Liebe Nicht Er Liebe Nicht Nicht whatever this is. Something in German. I think it means he loves me, he loves me not. I think that was the English subtitle. Also, everybody who knows German in the background, probably super offended. Ich bin ein Berliner. That's all I got. Totally nailed it. Oh, thanks, I've been practicing. Er means him, and that's all you know. That's more than I know. I played Apollo Justice, and they threw Frowlin out a whole bunch. That's probably one of the ten German words I could probably come up with. Did you get this one in roller or did you get this roller coaster tycoon in a cereal box or the first one? That I don't know, because I bought all of my Roller Coaster Tycoon games, or they were given to me as gifts and not from cereal, so... I don't know which one was in which one. October 14th, two weeks to go. It's one hell of a game to get in a cereal box. I'd agree. The only games I ever played that came out of cereal boxes were Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, which I think came in every box of checks ever. And, uh, I guess related to that, Chex Quest, which also came in Chex. Did I pay off my loans? <laughs> no. What's this fiscal responsibility crap? Oh man, Chex Quest. <laughs> that was a game. Were you shooting mucus at the enemies, or were they shooting mucus at you, or... You were just fighting against Snot, from what I remember. And those are the only games that I think ever came out of a cereal box for me. Cereal, excuse me. They were shooting mucus and made of it. Oh man. It sounds about right. The Flemoids, yeah! Look up this GTA 5 video, it's hilarious. Oops, you're banned. You know, I should look up that video. Not because I want to. Well, 
I sort of want to. I mean, if there's so many spam bots trying to get you to watch it, it's... it's gotta be something, right? I mean, if it's on YouTube, it's not porn. I'd imagine. Hmm. Although I keep banning all the links to it, so... I don't remember the title anymore. Yeah, let's get another handyman. You. Da, 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 da. This guy. I clicked you before. Boobs diver. Diver. Yeah. Oh no, he's gone. Here you go, boobs diver. Proud of you. You did it. I had to stream the night of the Breaking Bad finale. I've never seen Breaking Bad, so today it's just another day. I mean, at the end, does the main character date the Weasley girl and then they kill Voldemort and Eris does things? Something like that. Darth Vader is actually Walt's father in chemistry. I've never seen it! Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to ruin the finale for you guys. My bad. Boobs Diver, you are a, uh... A handyman. Picked totally at random from the chat. Hmm. The underdog gets the girl and the jerk jock gets a dump truck full of horse poop dumped in his convertible. So I thought it would end. Hmm. October 28th, three days to go, and as long as... 179 park guests don't spontaneously explode. We should be fine. Hmm. I don't really watch a whole lot of TV. I don't really watch a whole lot of movies. I don't really do a whole lot of anything, to be honest. I just do college things and then stream now and then. And then take the GRE and botch the math section. Cough, cough. I do science, that's true. Men brains are not going to research themselves. And the scenario is done. $166,000 in this company. Do I consider doing something? No. Why bother? Is that preferable to doing nothing? I don't think so. Yeah, world record. I did it. Uh, well. What do we enter the name as? Hmm. Oh yeah, that's right, they have the new, uh... full-color Kappa face for Turbo People. Oh, Jubilant Higginsbottom, whose name I forgot. Jubilant Higginbottom. That's right. Boom. Well, there's the park. We did it. I guess. Jubilation! Yeah, jubilation! Not jubilant. Oh, I should have waited a few minutes. Oh, well. Well, that was Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. That's my computer steadily eating itself in the background. Oh, I'll get rid of that, get rid of that. Well, guys, it is 1.43 in the morning. My little IRC thing is flashing. Pipe came in. And Program Max, Programma X also came in at one point. I don't know if he's here anymore. Anyway, it is uh, 1.44 in the morning. I've got class and I have to be up for at 9 tomorrow, so I kind of need to sleep. 
I hate to say it. So, um... I guess thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll try to stream more when I get the chance. I've just been really busy recently. So, um... Thanks again for watching, guys. Uh, consider following the stream if you want. Uh, I don't really have a very good schedule, so... That might really be the only way to check stuff, I suppose. Or consider following my dumb Twitter where I talk about dumb things and all the coffee and tea I drink, which is potentially interesting? No, it's not. Anyway, thanks again for watching. Uh, hope to see you at the next stream, whenever that is. Maybe this week if I get a chance. I don't have any more exams until next week, so I might stream once or twice during the weekday. Um... And I guess if you want to hang out in the chat for a few minutes, I'll run a quick round of adverts and make like two dollars. Think of all the toilet paper and ramen noodles that I'll buy. I'll be rolling in it. Do I ever mix coffee with tea? No, because I actually... I don't hate myself that much. Not yet, anyway. Anyway, thanks again, and I'm off, I guess, incoming round of commercials, and, uh... Good night. You guys are the best. And now I need to sleep.